Oh, in this video I'm going to show you how to make fire ring using milk jugs. Now this will only work if the milk jug you use says HDPE on the bottom. To start, I cut a plastic gallon milk jug into small strips about 3 inches long and 1 inch wide. Then in each of the strips I cut a small slit. Now I repeat this about 50 times. First, as a test, I'll light just one strip on fire. At first, it seems to burn normally, but then it starts to melt and drips burning drips. Now this plastic, called high-density polyethylene, is composed of only carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen atoms. So, when it burns, the fumes are not toxic. However, do not burn other plastics as they will produce toxic fumes and chemicals. fire ring is quite impressive from even one trip of plastic. Here's a slow motion which looks pretty cool. Okay, now let's move on to the rest of the project. So I took some copper wire, made sure it had no rubber insulation on it, and threaded it through the slits in one of the strips from the milk jug. So I pulled it almost all the way through, leaving some space on the other end, then threaded it through again. This creates a loop to hold it in place, so even if you tilt it, it won't move. I repeat this process with all the plastic strips and get about a two foot long chain. I strung it between two sawhorses and tried to make sure all the strips were pretty much pointing down. I also put some aluminum foil underneath to catch the dripping fire, because so, otherwise I would burn all my grass. So to light it, I'm using a torch. What's happening here is the heat from the torch is causing the plastic strip to catch on fire. The heat from the plastic strips burning melts them, and the melted drops fall down and burn as they go. The result is quite spectacular. 